My name is Ivan Weiss, I'm a portrait photographer. My bread and butter work is headshots. So I work mainly with actors and performers. A headshot is something that they need as a marketing tool. It's kind of a standard thing within the industry. More and more people are realizing the value of having a professional headshot in other industries as well. So then beyond that, I work in portraiture where there's a lot more room for artistic interpretation. The advantage of the Affinity Photo app on iPad is that you can do everything that you do on the desktop but you don't need to be at your desk. The simplicity comes in in the interface. When you're working on an iPad, it's all about the touch screen. So it becomes a bit more intuitive the way you edit because you can use the pen with one hand and hand gestures with the other to move the image around, to zoom, to pan. More for me, it's about the way the interface is. So I use frequency separation all the time. I find it a very convenient way to make what are actually quite major edits, but without making the picture look edited. And in order to do that in other software, you have to go through several different actions to set it up. So it's really easy. You can record macros for frequent actions, save things as a preset, and that speeds things up when I'm doing my standard work for headshots. So that makes my workflow simpler and faster. With portrait work where I'm going to be colour grading, for example, as I shoot, what I see on the camera is it's shot with a flat profile. So to a photographer, that's what you expect to see on the back of a camera. To a client, it doesn't look quite so impressive to be able to throw that onto the iPad and add my colour grading from a preset just to give them an idea and show them immediately an idea of what the final product is going to look like. That's something that clients respond to a lot more. Affinity, they understand there doesn't feel to be anything that's in there as a gimmick that would sound great to a software developer but not actually useful for the photographer. 